are looking after in total uh, 770 orphans in Zimbabwe in three uh, different uh, parts of Zimbabwe. And out of the 770, we have got 11 who are doing uh, different degrees at three different Zimbabwean universities and more than 50 who are at high schools and the rest are primary school uh, children. Well, there is one hidden truth about how I've raised this amount or all this money. The truth is, lies on teamwork. You see me, there is a team around me and this team is a hard working team and there's team spirit. The team comprises my angelic students here at Teddy's, the common room, then uh, parents, friends and relatives, and the team behind all this again, it's uh, the such uh, trustees and Mwana Trust in Zimbabwe. These are the people who are in the trenches who are doing most of the donkey work. As a mass teacher and philanthropist, what I've just realized is at the end of the day, 24 hours is not enough. I wish if I could negotiate with well, whoever decided about 24 hours, if my day could be 26 hours, then I'll be able to do everything. The biggest plan we have right now is to form a state-of-the-art high school in Zimbabwe, in Nyanga, called Nyanga North High School. And this school, the dream for the whole charity is to form a school, a modern school, that will give the best education to the least privileged children in the Zimbabwean community. The truth is to come up with an adjective to describe how this community at St. Edward's has helped me. I don't have the suitable words to describe, but the word I normally use, it has been angelic. The truth, I wouldn't have achieved even 1% of what I have achieved right now if I were not at this school. The school, the students have been very, very, very supportive. A few years ago, uh, three of our houses uh, put on several events uh, and raised, I think, a total of £35,000 to help build some classrooms uh, in a school in Zimbabwe. Uh, and also to uh, create some boreholes so that the children could have decent water, most important thing in Africa. I think it's very engaging for our pupils. Uh, having raised the 35,000 in, th in three houses, uh, when Henry's charity was put forward for a vote as to what our charity would be last year, uh, he was uh, overwhelmingly the successful charity. Some of that was to do with the fact that we were already engaged with this charity. Some of it was to do with the fact that he is an enormously engaging man. His smile is one of the biggest smiles in Teddy's. Uh, and some of it was to do with the fact that it is a wonderful uh, and a very important charity.